BioRAM's basic focus is providing air emissions abatement. We do that using primarily biological solutions, but we do, in certain cases, combine them with other conventional technologies. We've just recently set up manufacturing as well as uh, sales and engineering offices in China to, to better focus on the Asian market. BioRAM's key customers uh, are, are quite varied. Primary customers are municipalities, but we also deal with a variety of industries, whether it's pharmaceuticals, petrochemical, uh, chemical productions. Canada is fairly well positioned in this sector. Canada also has a lot of advantages in terms of being able to access not only the U.S. but other markets. So we're very culturally diverse and I think that gives Canadian companies a very strong advantage. One of the biggest challenges in the clean tech industry is working capital. Capital intensive business tends to be somewhat lumpy um, as you undertake a new capital project and then complete that project. The projects are also quite long and they could uh, uh, take up to 18 months to complete. So during that time you need a lot of cash. Cash to purchase raw materials, cash to pay your employees and cover your overheads uh, until you can deliver the product and then invoice the customer. With the long sales cycle, we uh, also carry uh, fairly large receivables. In, uh, as a young company, the traditional banks are often hesitant to allow you to borrow or to obtain a working line of credit against those receivables. One of our first experiences with EDC was to uh, obtain insurance against foreign receivables. In this case, we were able to line up uh, an insurance on our U.S. receivables and working with our bank, they provided us up to 90% working line of credit against our receivables. Without EDC's uh, insurance policy, the bank would have been unable to advance us that working line. The relationship with EDC has matured quite nicely. Over time, as we took on larger jobs, we found we needed uh, more capital for providing performance bonds. Our company is getting more complex as we expand internationally, particularly in the last three years, we've increased our operations in China. As we get into more complex financing arrangements, EDC is well equipped to help us. Cleantech Stretch is a corporate priority of EDC, and what that does is allow EDC to look outside the traditional box to put solutions in place that will help green companies and uh, clean tech companies expand where normally they wouldn't be able to. So Byram has improved their cash flow position to a point where we can bring the banks in to discuss some lending facilities, an operating credit or expanded uh, bonding where they can bid on further bonds, uh, whether it be international or domestic. When our clean tech corporate priority came into uh, effect in early 2012, I knew that it was a great fit for Biorem. And that has been the best thing uh, with working with Biorem, to knowing that you've got great management and uh, great Canadian technology, and then finding that uh, there is a way that we can help them at EDC and uh, getting them where they need to be. I would certainly recommend EDC to other environmental companies in Ontario and across Canada. EDC understands the nature of our business, uh, the complexity of the business, and it appears to me that they've dealt with our circumstances many times before.